uh, Apple Arcade had a tremendous update this past week. Uh, on Friday, they dropped up. They were up to 180 plus games. Now, c- damn them for getting me back into threes. You remember threes, the tile mm-hmm. number game? They they released they released through Apple Arcade, Monument Valley, Threes, Fruit Ninja, and a bunch of other classic games. Uh, Cut the Rope remastered as part of it, but all the ones that are just like basically the same game, but with like a plus by it. Uh, it's for Apple Plus, uh, Arcade Plus, or whatever. Um, they're the same game. My save games are still there from when I played Threes and got a high score of like nine thousand something. Right. So, damn you for bringing it back to my attention. But also, they have uh, a game from the Final Fantasy creators. Um, they have a, a version, we'll say a version, of uh, NLB. I'm sorry, get my letters messed up. NBA 2K um, Arcade Edition, which is great because I'm not really into the simulators. Um, it's got some wild, good-looking stuff on here uh, from some, some great, um, some great uh, 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 developers. So I mean, it, it, it's it's nothing that's like a real like you know it's not a lot of Sonic the Hedgehog or anything like that you know big brand stuff. But if you're just like I want to watch I want to play some wild new games, this is kind of the place to be. Uh, one of them that I've been playing, other than Threes, damn you, is uh, one that came out last week called Wonder Box. <laughs> it's called The Adventure Maker. It is kind of think. Do you remember that game Fez, where everything was kind of like a square spinning level kind of situation? It's like that. It's kind of that platformer, platformer kind of thing, but a little more, um, you know, adventure uh, kind of area. And I think I think what they're showing, I think you can actually build some of these levels. You know, it's got a, you know, it looks great, plays great on the phone, uh, you know, both in touch with the controller. I was think I was playing with it a little bit on my uh, Apple TV as well. And and the whole you know the whole idea is you go through the path and then like you spin the level and you can find like other secret passages and, and things like that like everything's like on this like floating box of a thing. Uh, I am now a cat, by the way, uh, <laughs> playing this thing. And there's a frog too. Look at them. Uh, so like, Wonder Box is, was the one I've been playing. But um, again, it's just just a lot of cool stuff for Discovery there. Speaking of Discovery, there's a Star Trek game. It's like an RPG game. It looks like one of those games that you would be like. It looks like a game that should have. Uh, freemium options to it like I should have gems and here's all the characters like the Power Rangers game or the Dragon Ball game where like here's all the characters and and but you gotta like upgrade and buy them and stuff right it's like that but it doesn't have the annoying freemium stuff to it it's like this weird kind of uh, Star Trek RPG you know Final Fantasy looking RPG kind of uh, turn base uh, situation so so yeah Apple Arcade has been really really bumping up and it's a lot right now for five bucks if you got if you have an apple device you know especially if you got bigger screens like an ipad or an apple tv it's really worthwhile and just throw an app uh, xbox controller on there and you're good to go so have you have you played this uh what is it skate park i think it's just called skate skate city maybe it's basically the skate it's skate city skate city that was that was pretty cool. Yes. And then um trying to see here. This arcade. Mini Motorways has been a good one for me. Um uh I you know just diving into the other random things. Uh and again uh, Lego Brawls is still fun they're during in pirate mode right now. Mm-hmm. Uh, there's a Jurassic Park <laughs> Jurassic World level that's been uh, a lot of fun lately. Um, but the Skate City game, that was one. I think that's one from the uh, Aldo's Adventure uh, group, right? Uh, we we actually found it when we were in the Apple Store not too long ago. Yeah, and it's um, and it was on the it was on the device. It was on one of the devices there. Christopher was playing. Oh it. yeah, that's one they definitely put over. They, they, uh, their Apple Arcade display is pretty tremendous. I was there when I was getting my um, my. Uh, uh, I actually got my battery replaced in my in my eight plus. So uh, I'm I'm trying to last at least until the next one, and uh, I've had this phone, uh, Chilla. I've ha- I've had this phone for three years. This is the last one. This is the same year the X came out, right? And uh, and I played an ungodly amount <laughs> for it because you know I, I just it's it's got ha- it's got like two fifty six of uh, uh, gigs on it. It's got you know whatever high end camera they had at the at the time and everything. And I was like, damn it, I'm gonna uh, fifty bucks to get another six months out of this thing. I'm in. 
to give me three and a half years with the same phone. That's ridiculous. And I still feel oh, that's not bad for a battery at all. It, it, yeah. It, well, uh, I'm right on the edge. So, so Missy got the X at the same time I did, which was, that was the choices at the time, right? Of the new phones, mm -hmm. um, starting with the X and basically everything that that's form factor on there, it was 50 bucks for, um, basically eight plus and below. And then it is 70 for everything else. That's an X and up. Which is still isn't bad. That's still not bad. Still not bad. I, I obviously run mine probably a little harder than hers does, so I don't think she needs it. But I, it was just I'm traveling. I don't want to take this to an airport, and the thing's not going to last, right? So that that was basically the the only motivation for that. Batteries are my issue. I took my MacBook in because the battery was swelling again. Like batteries are always my issue, as long as I'm not dropping my phones in the toilet again, like I did those years ago. But uh, <laughs> so, um, but yeah. What else we got to talk about? I think that's it video games wise. Uh, Among Us is going to get 15 player lobbies and new art style. I think a new level came out there. I got to get I got to get an Among Us party going again. It's been a it's been about a month or two. 